dude, come on. It's like six days in December. It's time to shave that thing. <laughs> no, I kind of like it. And to be honest, I don't really want to clean it a whole thing up. It's just going to take way too long. But nobody's going to want to kiss that caterpillar sitting on your upper lip, especially on New Year's. Plus, you're starting to look like cash. One cash soup for at your service. Hey, Coops, you're looking good, pal. Yeah, you and me. The almost we twins, right? Eh? Uh, yeah. On second thought, give me those. Ah, good choice, my friend. <laughs> what is going on, everybody? It's your man, Zach Hoops, and welcome back to this week's episode of Zach's Picks of the Week, everybody. Welcome back, and we have got some awesome recommendations coming from the website, CanadianBees.ca, for you to check out. So I have handpicked five good ones for you this week, so you're welcome very much. And if you also wouldn't mind, be sure to hit that subscribe button and punch that notification bell right in the friggin' dinger on YouTube if you're watching this video so that you know when the next videos are coming out, and be sure to slap a like on this video. And if you're watching us on Instagram, be sure to do everything in that order except for be sure to follow hit the heart and send this off to your friends but like i said before i've got five awesome recommendations for you from our website canadianbeats.ca that i'm sure is going to tickle your fancy this week but if not then you can also just go over to the website and find yourself a better recommendation for yourself because you obviously have a better taste in music of course so eh, but whatever i'm just gonna be a little salty if you just want to do that so if not, then you want to take my recommendations, then of course, let's get things started right here on Zach's Picks of the Week. Let's kick this party off with number five. What do you say, everybody? We'll be kicking things off here at number five with Canadian R&B artist Jenna Nation, who has unveiled her new holiday single, My Christmas Wish. It was written by Jenna and was produced by Juno Award-winning and Grammy-nominated producer Roger Ryan. But My Christmas Wish has all the trimmings and tapings of a favorite holiday ballad. The piano and the slow beats, the snaps and the strings all coming together at the right time. Please be sure to go check out the full article over on the website. It's going to be linked in the description down below there. And of course, we're going to check out this clip from the brand new single from Jenna Nation. This is going to be My Christmas Wish here at number five on Zach's Picks of the Week. Everybody get you the holiday spirit. So I heard that new Taylor Swift album is a big deal, but personally I actually haven't listened to it yet. Yeah, I've just been too busy, I got caught up in that new Toronto, Ontario indie folk singer-songwriter Holly Claudius' debut album, Rose Garden. Be sure to go check it out now on all streaming platforms. The album delivers elements of folk, pop, rock, and Americana with honest lyrics and soulful vocals throughout. This new album, Rose Garden, was written entirely during isolation of the early parts of 2021. But one of my personal favorites of the album is called Strawberry Blonde and it's the first one on the album, so be sure to go check it out on all streaming platforms now but we're also going to check out this clip coming up right here on zach's picks of the week here at number four so without further ado everybody what do you say we check it out right here this is strawberry blonde by the very talented holly claudius here at zach's picks of the week Alright, next up we've got the very talented singer-songwriter and producer Alana Maddie from Toronto who has unveiled her dream pop folk single, Loved You First, on all streaming platforms, so be sure to go check it out. And it is also accompanied by a brand new lyrical video for the release, so be sure to go check that out over on the website. This new single is from Alana's forthcoming album, Thoughts and Feelings, which will be coming out in 2022, so be sure to keep your eyes out because that is coming up very soon because we're already at the end of 2021. However, be sure to go check out the full article over on the website. It's going to be linked in the description down below for the release of this brand new single but speaking of which we're gonna be showing you a clip from this brand new single right here is called loved you first by elena maddie here at number three on zach's picks of the week this week so get in your car I 
Hey, Zach, a uh, question for you, but uh, this next one coming up here. The author says Zach Cooper. Do we know that guy? I don't think so, but he sounds like a handsome dude. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. What is he promoting? We've got to come up next. It's Ontario's powerhouse of rock and roll, Bad Holiday. That is right. My friends are back, and they have unveiled their latest single and video called Island, which is apparently where you're going to end up if your manager ever makes you fly in a seaplane to the gig. This new single is a very chill and laid-back track, making it the perfect song for drinking tonight. But to be honest, all their songs are actually great for drinking. Be sure to go check out the new single on all streaming platforms now, and go and check out the video which debuted over on Canadian Beats. But of course, we've got this clip from the video right here for you to check out here on Zach's Picks of the Week. So without further ado, everybody, this is going to be Bad Holiday and their brand new single, Island, at number two this week. Rising and rising, flooding the shores inside of your mind. I said trussle, brewery, or nothing. We'll not settle the steam whistle here. This final recommendation is going to be for the very cheeky new single coming from Canadian electronica artist Tall Tale. She has just unveiled the official music video for her latest single, Tennis Club. Be sure to go check it out on all your favorite streaming platforms now. The music video follows the lyrics' lighthearted approach to comparing the game of love to the game of tennis. With it ranking over 330,000 streams as an independent artist, Tall Tale has cemented her sound and stance as one of Canada's most promising pop writers. If you'd like to learn more, be sure to go check out the full article over on the website canadianbeats.ca. But of course, this is going to be it at number one here on Zach's Picks of the Week. Everybody, let's check out a clip from the brand new video for Tennis Club. Big round of applause for our number one choice this week. It is going to be Tall Tale. Working so hard at this thing I don't like. I feel so out of place under fluorescent lights. Around all these happy people who don't got you on their mind. Give me my recommendations for Zach's Picks of the Week, so thank you very much for checking them all out, and be sure to go find them over on the website, CanadianBeats.ca, which is going to be linked to the description right down below there, here on this YouTube video, or if you want to go check us out on Instagram, be sure to go check us out on LinkedIn in the bio there, and you can go check out the website, Canadian Beats, right there, where in my opinion, you're going to find some of the best Canadian music, so what do you say, and just stop wasting your time and go over there and check out some brand new music, all right? And be sure to follow us on all your favorite social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, or just click in on the Metaverse person you can see what my list is i don't know how to do that yet of course i'm probably never gonna learn how to do that but whatever it's uh your boy zach coops i hope you all enjoyed have yourself an amazing week out there be sure to spread some love peace love and good music and uh yeah hope you're having a good one out there all right i'll have a pretty good week actually i just shaved so i look pretty good actually feeling pretty sexy what's up <laughs> but yeah that's it uh i'll see you guys in the next one all right have a good one Peace. I'm going to break the glass.